Okay, so what's going on guys? Mr. Dalek JD here and welcome to a slightly different video to what you're normally used to. You probably see me go straight into a zombie game and play for you guys. This is going to be sort of a different video. Now, I'm close to reaching 500,000 subscribers, which is just just absolutely insane. Like I can't comprehend it. I'm going to be doing something very special for 500,000 subscribers. So, leading up to that, it's just hit me that you know, there's been a lot of new subscribers recently and a lot of you guys may not know exactly how I started out. So I thought for a fun video, we'll go and look back at some of my old, old videos to see when I first started making YouTube videos and start making zombie videos and see how embarrassing it is. And uh, hopefully you guys will find this sort of enjoyable as well. So I really hope you guys enjoy this. If you do, drop it a like rating and honestly let me know if you enjoy these type of videos. Of course, normal live commentaries will be coming back tomorrow. But I'd just like to know if you guys are interested in these sort of real life videos where you get to know a little bit more about me. But let's go. Okay, hey everyone, this is Mr. Dalek JD. And today I'm going to be bringing you a live commentary on the map Kino de Toten. And at this moment in time, both of my friends I'm playing with have gone somewhere ah that was oh no that's not good oh dearie me so this was back when call of duty black ops 1 first came out literally like around about a month i actually really liked playing the zombies mode on it and i never really recorded it until this video you're seeing right here so it's picture what was going on as you see the round i'm playing with two friends two of them were afk and then one of them comes back and then we're trying to protect this one person and I don't know why but for some reason it just went down really well on my channel. You could just tell that you know I wasn't very confident at talking and I didn't really know what to say. I had a really terrible mic and if you can picture this I was using a rock band mic and I literally would sit like this with my legs up like that. I'd have the mic in between my legs like that so you know say what you want. And I'm playing the game like that and I have to talk like that so it wasn't a very good setup. But uh, it's an enjoyable video nonetheless. We start the Recording. Or maybe it's his brother's playing or something, I don't know. Mm, I don't know. Was that like I'm gonna show your mom? There's no point getting Lewis up, he can just, you know, when he comes back. <laughs> I want my money back! I want to upgrade this org. I link the teleporter, so. I want a ray gun. I don't have enough points yet. Do you have monkey bombs? Oh, it's just Lewis that has monkey bombs. Stupid glitch again! Oh no! Amount of ammo, and there's more zombies. Holy crap! How am I gonna live? How am I gonna do this? He's teleported without me. Anything I ah? Oh. Saying the only thing I can do is join the party, but I can't. This is ridiculous. I am one and. For once and truly screwed. I need him to come back and help me. Help me! Help me! I'm so screwed. Shotgun shit. I get the box. Oh, I need that. I'm just like. Throw some grenades near the stairs. Oh shit. We are bound to die. I'm trying, but they've got both stairs. I can move, but take me down! Yeah, we're dead. Yeah, we're dead. That was a good game. <laughs> <coughs> oh well. Hope you enjoyed the quick video. Yeah. We can we can do a lot better, but you know. Oops, took my controller. Anyway, thanks for watching. See you. Bye.
So I think I ended that video pretty well, you know, it was kind of entertaining and definitely that bit in the last room in Kino there, that was pretty damn impressive. Now, this next one is a tutorial guide. I kind of wasn't sure if live commentary was my thing and I thought I was generally good at zombies, which a lot of you guys will actually agree with, but making a guide for the map 5 was very, very weird and the way I started this video was probably the worst way I've ever started a video. Top of the morning to ya. Top of the morning to ya. Top of the morning to ya. Nah, I'm just kidding. Hey everyone, this is Mr. Dalek JD, and in this video, I'll be bringing you a very detailed tutorial on a strategy for the map 5, also known as the Pentagon. And in this guide, I'll be showing you everything basically what rounds to go where, when to buy guns, how much you should get when to where to camp when to get what everything you'll need to know is in this guide you'll be able to get to at least round 25 plus if you've got some decent players okay as you can see here i'm just a just just four to six thousand so i've opened the first door and i've opened the lift for everyone it's so basically at the start of round six uh don't mess around with the playing around with the zombies getting them towards you just buy the lift go down and as soon as you get out the the lift, go over and buy the MP5K. It's not brilliant, but it will do. It won't cost that much of your points. And once you bought the MP5K, whoever has the most points, I suggest buys the debris downstairs. Okay, so we've managed to get the lift open, and don't do it for the kid done. Just get everyone in the lift. No messing about. All right, so this lift is going to bring you to the room with the electricity, which we'll need to turn on, obviously to get the actual teleporters on and what we're going to be doing also is getting the mystery box w which is very useful as it's in this big room here which also has claymores it's very important that you buy claymores no matter how many points you have now, as you can see here i'm g having quite a bit of trouble here so someone throws a monkey i think so I actually managed to get into the pack a punch room as you can see here uh, there's two windows behind here, so that's one for each per. That's one window for two people. Well, no, actually, no. Two windows are shared by two people. You want to knife the glass again, so you can get the maximum amount of points out of it. And two people sit at the front. And what happens here is when the Defcons go from five to one, the front door will open and the Pack a Punch machine itself will disappear. Right, I'm going to press play now. Okay, so hey everyone, we're now into round 20, and as you can see, I've managed to get an upgraded HK-21 and an upgraded ray gun. And for some reason, I don't know why, but the capture card just picked up the main menu music for some reason, instead of the actual zombie sound in this. But um, anyway, as you can see, I've taken up position at the front now, seeing as uh, one of the guys in my team left. As you can see, you just have two people mowing up the zombies here. And as you can see, the points collect up quite quick. Only a few of them will die. When they're at the monkey bomb, blow the fuck out of them with your guns. Just shoot them, shoot them, shoot them. I can't stress that enough. Amazing advice from myself there. Just shoot them, shoot them, shoot them. I'm sure no one else has done that before in zombies. So there's your number one tip. Right, this next video is just like one I got into a game of zombies and there was an argument going on. And uh, I won't play all of it because a lot of it is very explicit and kind of racist as well. But I'll just show you the weird, weird parts. Like, this is really creepy. I'm going to shoot your mouth with some double points. Come down in it. Exactly. Come down to London, you little puff. I think it's Aaron in your lips. Oh, Batum, if you come down here. You don't know who I am, bro? Blood? I'm your dad. Shut the fuck up. Hey, 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 your nano, your mom, mate, you fucking eye wanky, no one, mate, I'm fucking hardcore, your mom. Ah, uh, a bit dead. What? Geek. Oh, I'm just, uh, the and I'm hearing fucking your mom beating me down, beating me. 
Hey, Tony, you know, you know, you know, if you don't know, yeah, 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 you're doing this yet, bro. I don't care, hey, bro, don't pick me up, yo, you're a fucking slag. You're shit. I really need to make it. I'm your pussy as well, bro. Fuck you, bro. Yeah, that was kind of weird. To uh, American viewers, you may not understand what was going on. That's kind of how um, young children act like in the UK. They 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 class themselves as what we call chavs, which are just horrible. Uh, just, they just they just use horrible language, and they think they're they're really good. And it's a little bit of an education lesson for you lot. But now let's jump into something a little bit different. So we're going back now, back before Black Ops, and this is actually uh, Undead Nightmare, a DLC uh, add-on for a game called Red Dead Redemption. And uh, this is just really weird to see how the quality's really changed in my videos. I used to use a, um, a Dazzle capture card. Oh, it's awful. But enjoy this little funny snippet. Um, otherwise, you're fucked. Down here. Oh yeah, Dead Eyes also very good, but I don't need to use it right now because I'm a beast. Ow! Wow! Well, thanks for the hell. You see, I'm a, I'm a friend in need. Yeah, don't What the hell? I don't want to open the coffin. Ah! Wow! So wow! All right. Like as usual, we're oh, as fuck. usual. Ah! As usual, you're a oh, faggot, bitch. He's actually in the coffin. <laughs> oh. <laughs> He's actually in the coffin. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <here we> <laughs> <laughs> the jaws of the undead. He's back It's not. 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 Get me off! Oh, wow. Yeah, we are! Wow! Oh. Good work! Perfect. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're going to fall over. Should we try again? No. Should we try? No. Well, that was a fucking fail. We do better. We got to round 15 and then killed ourselves. But, you know, I was just like a bit of gameplay. Introduce, reintroduce myself to my channel. Go back to that map that we did it Subscribe. If you want more Red Dead gameplays, I can do that. I might do a really crappy Modern Warfare 2 commentary to finish off the lifetime of that rubbish game. And that's it. See ya. <laughs> I can't believe I said that about Modern Warfare 2. I don't think that now. That, that game is actually pretty awesome, but that made me laugh myself. Like... That was so random of me to come out of that. I was just like, no, no, this is shit, this is shit. I'm going to end it with my very first ever video, which you're going to be like, jeez, this was like six years ago. I had a Nintendo Wii and nothing else. And uh, this is pretty diabolical quality as well. And my voice, man. Hi, this is Dalek JD. And today we're going to be reviewing this game. Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Games. Now I tell you, this game is a workout for the for the Wii. It seriously tires you out, but I guess that's what the Olympics would really do to you. Except in the real Olympics, you wouldn't be waggling your remote and nunchuck up and down. That sounded a bit nasty. Just get to the main menu. Now, Sonic's very fast, but for some reason I like playing as Mario. Mainly because he's my favourite gaming character of all time. Old beast, let's get your little boost. Now let's do it. See, I'll beat everyone by miles. Woohoo! I'm the wiener! How did I know he was going to say that? Look at that. Mario in pure style. He's, over, he's more than 20 years old and he still runs and beats everyone. Just comes out on top all the time.
I bet even his brother's jealous. He only came, like he only came third. Nah, nah, cut that, cut that. But guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you did enjoy it, do let me know down below in the comment section. I'd really like to take your feedback in because this is a kind of different video. And I wanted it to be one where you get to know me a little bit better. Uh, because I really want to start doing face cam and stuff like that in the future. So let me know if that's something you're definitely into. Drop the video a like rating as well if you enjoyed. Uh, 500k subs is coming right around the corner. Honestly guys, I can't thank you enough for all your continued support on my videos. And uh, I'll tell you guys now, for 500k, I was going to do a Q&A. So that's why I've sort of done this video as a sort of tester to see how you guys enjoyed it. And uh, I'm really looking forward to do this, doing this Q&A. And I'll uh, release a video soon on details on how to get your questions in for that. But thank you so, so much for watching. And have an awesome day. Hush now, child. And don't you cry. Folks, my